out loud, I'm just like, yo, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I'm straight. I'm straight. I lean back in my chair and I'm like, help me. Help me. I don't ever, I don't want to make it sound like I, this is a fun thing to do or this is something you should do. But this is just something I wanted to try and I kind of got peer pressured low key. I'll tell you about that later, but like, yeah, I would not, I'm not saying to do it or saying it's a, it's a right thing to do, but guys just, I always say stay away from anything, drugs, alcohol, anything like that. <laughs> It was funny, but at the time I was really scared. And I could laugh at it now, but it's actually pretty scary. Like, so to give you backstory, I never ever smoked. I never smoked in my life. Like I don't, only thing I've ever done is edibles. Let's get, let's get spicy, let's get, let's get spicy. So this happened um, in last year, beginning of last year, around March-ish. I'm gonna be honest guys, I was feeling a little depressed. I was down and that's when the devil is trying to tempt you, trying to distract. And at that time, I wasn't really into God. I, I wasn't practicing religion at all. I was kind of going with the wind kind of thing. And, that and real quick, you guys, I wanted to, I'm editing the video, but I realized I never actually explained why I'm feeling this way, why I was feeling depressed. And it was just because of my family issues, my um, relationship issues. I was having a lot of stress from that and also from just college from the quarantine i really felt lonely not gonna lie so that's basically what i wanted to explain real quick but back to the story <laughs> so now we're going into the actual day right so i'm staying actually i'm actually staying at my ex's father's house like his house for a little so we were like i was sleeping over we were like playing games and like having fun or whatever your game we're playing guitar here i think or something like that i'm low-key being peer pressured by her family um to to try an edible and you guys i don't smoke i haven't done anything that seed that planted the seed in my head right so later on that day she's like she's like you sure you don't want an edible like it would make my day if i could just see you you high like i just they wanted to see what i would be like i don't know looking back now i really don't know why i did it but i was just like you know what i'm gonna try it she said she'll do it with me so i was like all right i guess i i'll just you know try this out for for the for the one time i eat the edible i take it from her and i eat it and at first i don't feel anything i'm like i'm good i'm straight like you know this feels and that's how edibles work you you eat them and then 5 15 30 minutes later you feel it so i i eat the edible 15 minutes goes by i'm not feeling anything i'm like what is this like yo this is light like they, they thought they thought i was really gonna get high off of this one I'm like all right 20 minutes goes by 30 minutes 40 minutes goes by i still don't feel anything right 50 it happened around like an hour or so later right and slowly i'm like slowing down i'm like i lean back in my chair and i'm like help me help me brownies that they that they made were like full brownies and i ate like half of it and you're not supposed to eat that much. You're supposed to eat like like maybe this much. Not much though. You're not supposed to eat a lot. Grabbing my phone, looking at looking at the time, looking at my notifications. And then I look over at my girlfriend and she's like, she's like laughing at me. And she's like, like they're all just looking at me. Like they're just all looking at me like laughing, right? <laughs> so I'm like, yo, I might be high. They're like, Sage, do you so do you feel high? I'm like, mm, nah, not yet, not yet out loud i'm just like yeah I'm, I'm good i'm good i'm straight i'm straight but in reality bro i'm looking <laughs> i don't trust them anymore i'm like yo they got me high I'm in, <laughs> I'm in here sitting i'm sitting here high i'm like yo i don't know what's going on so i end up going to my room and i'm like on snapchat like taking videos of myself posting on instagram <laughs> like, yo i was wild like just hands down the worst experience I've ever had. I would never want to do this again. I don't suggest it. Any of you that are curious, like, oh, I have a fear of missing out on, you know, what it would be like to be high or anything like that, bro, you're not missing out on it. If you guys like this video though, um, hit the like button. If you want to hear more story times, I have a bunch of story times about, you know, my first time doing stuff. Experiences in college that I've just never really said it on the internet, but I'm just gonna see more. Like the video if you haven't already. I'll be double uploading today, so stay tuned and um, I'm out of here. Make sure you guys stay happy, stay positive, stay winning. 
I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out, y'all.